and and I and salt, then ice. In my case, I like matcha the best. Ice, two resealable bags, one big and one small, and lastly, salt. Carefully pour one cup of milk into the small bag. Full cream is the best if you're not watching your weight. Then you add the sugar. You can add more if you like. There are a variety of flavorings that you can add, like vanilla extract and of course chocolate. But today, I prefer matcha. Make sure you seal the bag properly, leaving just enough space inside for shaking. Next, fill one third of the big bag with ice. Crush ice is ideal if available. Followed by 3 tablespoons of salt. Rock salt is preferred but table salt will do as well. Then, carefully place a small bag inside the big bag. Ensure that it is sealed tightly. Add more ice enough to cover both sides. Add the rest of the salt. Why, you may ask, is salt needed? Salt is an important component in ice cream making because salt makes the ice colder longer. Now that we have the small bag inside of the ice bag, now we will shake it. Shaking will ensure that the mixture will freeze evenly. One more minute until we find out if this experiment was a success. bags big and small and and I and salt then ice two ziplock bags one big one small and of course ice it's not ice that's salt ready <laughs> dog on the girlfriend oh yes <laughs> Hello, I said that the 
already dug. I see. <laughs> okay, come on, you can do it. Okay, when I count to ten, I want no, no, a serious face. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. Okay, one. Thank you, thank you. I see the. A game. But first, we need milk, sugar to taste, depending on how sweet you like your ice cream to be, flavoring. Personally, I like matcha the best. Ice, two Ziploc bags, one big, one small, and lastly, salt. <laughs> I was about to say salt. 